three of the most popular questions I receive almost on a daily basis is, what are the property taxes? Will the property taxes remain the same after I purchase the property? And how do I know that I'm paying the appropriate amount of property taxes? In other words, you're not overpaying property taxes. Well, it all comes down to the assessment value. The assessment value is what the government looks at that property to be worth. Typically, these values are really nowhere near market value. They could be potentially and most likely under the real market value. And sometimes, depending if they're indexing things, particularly on waterfront lots, I find, they could be indexed over the actual value. So number one, what are the property taxes? Well, there's just not one number for property taxes because in PEI, there's the property taxes and then there's a local resident discount. So if you are a resident of PEI, you will receive a discount that's approximately one third of the property taxes. It's on your tax bill. I think it's the second line down. It's called a credit. Secondly, as far as will those property taxes remain the same after you purchase the property? Well, one of the users, users of our system, Paragon, our MLS that we use internally, is the provincial government. So they actually do watch what these properties transact at, and in some cases, they will adjust your taxes to be more appropriate to what you paid for that property. When you get into the rural areas of PEI, those assessment values can be quite whacked or unrealistic based on what the actual marketplace price is. And that could be either in a positive, but most likely in a negative number. So if you're buying a property for 450,000 and the assessment value is 125,000, you're probably gonna be seeing an increase in property taxes, depending on where you are in the island, what city you're in, uh, what rural community, those property taxes could be significant or insignificant in the case of most rural properties. Finally, are you paying the right amount of property taxes? When you look at your assessment value, that assessment value should probably come under the actual market value, typically in the past by about 18%. Now it's a little different because our market's going crazy and that number is probably exponentially lower than actual market value. Market value defined as what people will pay for the property. So in order to find out if you're paying the right amount of property taxes, have a formal appraisal done or have a CMA or two or three done by a real estate agent or broker, and then make an application to the government, which comes with your tax form every year, or you can probably find a copy online to apply to have those taxes reduced. And in most cases, if not all, the provincial government's extremely fair and they do a great job. So that's it for this video. Be sure to hit the subscribe button, the little bell beside it. And if you'd like to see listings before they hit MLS and also be offered PEI real estate tips, tricks, and traps, be sure to join my mailing list on my website. Have a great day. Thanks for watching and enjoy.